remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? The cause of death has been revealed for up-and-coming Minnesota rapper Lexi Allergé, who died at the tender age of 21 on New Year's Day. The medical examiner says that it was a combination of alcohol and drugs, specifically fentanyl and ethanol. 21 years old. Had a lot of promise. On a personal note, I didn't know who she was until I found out about her death. She appeared to have a cult-like following. It was small, but it was bubbling. She released the album in 2015 and another in 2017, but a major accomplishment in music up until the point that she died was a feature she did called Jealous with Kalani. Reading some of the comments online, she appeared to be a good person. People kept saying how nice she was, how sweet she was, how humble she was, how talented she was. And one family member said she'd always leave you with, I love you, when she walk away from the people that was in her life. She'd always say, I love you. So, appeared to be a good person. But she made a major error in judgment. I don't think that a lot of young people just really realize how deadly mixing alcohol and drugs are. Now, either one can kill you, but you mix them together and that is a guaranteed recipe for disaster. That's why if you take any drugs, you read the label, it'll tell you do not drink alcohol. That is a guaranteed way to kill yourself. Now, reading the article about her death and the cause of death, they summed it up to an accident. <sighs> it's hard for me to accept that when you know the dangers of alcohol and drugs and you mix them anyway. You know, to me, that's like, that's like suicide. That's like committing suicide. I don't really see that as an accident. To me, it's equivalent to a drunk driver getting behind the wheel of a vehicle, knowing he's intoxicated, probably received a warning from his friends probably stumbled to the car, couldn't find his keys, took off anyway, and wrapped his vehicle around a utility pole. Was that really an accident? Anyway, man, condolences to the family, friends, and fans. Y'all hold your head. No more talk. What the haters talking about? Yeah.